Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to another advent calendar unboxing. As you can see, today we're unboxing the John Lewis Beauty Advent Calendar. So this went on sale on Monday the 4th. I was online at midnight on the Sunday, so I managed to pick it up just after midnight and I paid for next day delivery, so it did come today, Tuesday. This is £159 to buy. There are 25 drawers inside, but there's 26 products. There is a double door, which I think will be Christmas Day. The value is over £600, so I think this is probably one of the best value calendars at this kind of price point and I'm so excited for this one. I'm so glad I managed to get my hands on it. So it did actually sell out midday on Monday, um, but then it was restocked later on on Monday. So if you are interested in this advent calendar, although it is showing out of stock right now, um, you can put your email address in and John Lewis will actually send you a reminder when it is back in stock. So just keep checking, just keep refreshing the page, check your emails and hopefully they'll restock them. So I don't really know whether they're releasing them in batches or if it's just if they get the odd one back in stock. I'm not too sure, but either way, just keep checking because it did come back in stock yesterday. So just before we dive into this video, if you do like these advent calendar unboxings, please give this video a thumbs up and also hit subscribe. And if you're not sure which advent calendar is for you, I do have two big beauty advent calendar roundup videos that I did. Uh, where I talk through over 60 different advent calendars. So I'll link those up here, one after the other, and also in the description down below if you want to check those out and just get an idea of prices, what's inside them, when they go on sale, and which one is right for you. So without further ado, let's have a look at this advent calendar. So this year they've gone for this really, really bright, colourful pink, blue, and purple design. So this is the sleeve that comes off and then inside it this is the box here so it does open like a wardrobe but what i really like about this one is it doesn't just open like that it opens all the way back so you can keep the doors really out of the way so as with all of these kind of advent calendars with the drawers obviously they are reusable and um, they're fully recyclable as well if you didn't want to keep them but if you do want to keep them it's nice to have these little drawers but what they've done this year with this one um is although the front of them have obviously got the numbers on once you take them out you can spin them around so it is just completely plain on the other side which means you can definitely reuse it, you can have it on display without all the numbers so it's not obvious that it's an advent calendar and yeah, it's definitely reusable um, I think this is why they've gone for less of a Christmassy kind of colour scheme as well so they've gone for just more bright colours yeah, it's not too Christmassy all year round but that's amazing so I'm really really pleased with that okay, so let's dive into it then so in drawer number one we're kicking off the advent calendar with a product from Augustina's Veda this is the Rich Cream there's 15ml of product here and this is worth £61.50 so this is a really rich, nourishing, luxurious moisturiser for the face. Uh, this is something that I would use at night time. And the ingredients are also said to support cellular renewal in the skin as well to improve the appearance of your complexion and to keep it super hydrated and looking plump. So we're off to a really, really good start there. This is definitely an expensive cream. For 50ml of this is £205, so it's great to see this on day one in the advent calendar as well. Okay, day number two up here. So in day number two, we've got a product from Evolve and it's the Rose Quartz Facial Polish. So there is 30ml of product here. So this is worth £13. It's an exfoliating facial scrub. It's meant to remove dead skin cells, clogged pores, and improve the appearance of any scarring. So if you've got any acne scarring, um, it's meant to improve with this. It's 100% natural and it is vegan as well. It also contains organic rosehip oil, which fights the signs of aging. So if you've got any fine lines and wrinkles, then this is a good one to try. And also organic hibiscus extract, which works to break down dead skin cells and prevent any future breakouts. So that sounds fab, looking forward to trying that. I've not heard of that brand before, so that's a new one on me. On to day number three at the bottom. Oh, and we've got a product from Laura Mercier. This is the Au Naturel Caviar Stick Eye Colour. So this is a crayon eyeshadow pencil. This looks like it's in a really, really nice nudie shade. Let's have a look. So to me, that kind of gives me like concealer vibes. <laughs> it's literally like a really, really pale nudie kind of colour. So this would be a great base for eyeshadow. Um, I would definitely use this as a base and put a colour on top. So the website just says that this is inspired by Laura Mercier's Cult Classic Caviar Eyeliner. This eye colour offers a new technique to enhance the smoky eye look. This creamy formula provides endless options for a flawless smoky eye. So I mean it's not smoky colour but this would be a good base if you definitely want to blend some colours and get that smoky eye effect. So this is the travel size version and this is worth £13. That's still quite expensive uh, for an eye colour. And yeah, I'm going to look forward to using this as a base. I've not tried this before. On to day number four up here. Okay, so in day number four we've got a perfume from Hermes. And this is the L'Ombre de Marveille. I think I said that right, I don't know. So this is 7.5 mils. This is quite an expensive perfume. This size is actually worth £12.25. So it comes in a really, really nice bottle. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, it's like mirrored at the back as well. I can see myself in it. Oh, wow. That's cool. And it also comes with this little uh, ribbon as well. 
and it shows you how to tie it onto the top of the bottle so that's cute at least you won't lose it in your handbag let's have a smell this is quite like an expensive perfume to try oh that's so nice mmm that's definitely my kind of perfume I'm so glad I am quite fussy with perfume but that is really really nice I'm not going to try and describe it because I'm rubbish at describing perfumes but that is so so nice Um, yeah really excited about that one this isn't one I've seen in an advent colour before either so nice to get something a bit different okay on to day number five in the bottom corner oh we've got a product from Clinique so this is the Moisture Surge 100 hour auto replenishing hydrator oh I've not actually tried this one either this is what caught my eye with this calendar there's a lot of products in here that you're not getting in other calendars either so that is quite a big size so this is 15 mil maybe it's just a big pot so this size is actually worth £12.50 and this is good for all skin types whether you've got dry skin, oily skin, uh, combination skin and it's a really really hydrating moisturiser um, it's lightweight on the skin as well and yeah it's like a gel kind of cream consistency um, so this is something that I would use as a daytime moisturiser more for like summer um, if it's a gel like consistency but yeah I might put this one away and try that one in a few months time okay on to day number 6 this one here oh, little box in here oh this is quite a big one in here i just got a sneak peek at 24 that looks so good so this is another perfume oh it's two perfumes in here so this is from the brand called juliet has a gun never heard of this um it's the duo wardrobe including not a perfume and musk invisible so i've got two five mil perfumes in this box let's have a look so i've got two boxes in the box oh they're actually quite big for samples so this is the not a perfume yeah five mil that actually looks quite a lot like compared with the regular uh perfume sample sizes you get so that's kind of what i was expecting in there but yeah really really impressed with that mm, that one's probably not really my kind of thing let's try the musk one. Oh, the musk one is much nicer uh, yeah i think i like the musk one but not the not a perfume one so on the website this says perfume made out of a single element called cetalox it's usually used in perfumery as a base note it plays the lead role here um so they've kind of mixed up a little bit another advantage of this particular composition is that it's entirely allergen free the result is minimalist elegant and pure and then the musk one it says it's a fluffy scent as comfortable and unfussy as your favorite little pair of jeans a dreamy and nostalgic smell of comfy notes laying on a silky base of creamy musk so the not a perfume is worth 13 pounds in this size and the musk invisible is worth 13 pounds 33 so slightly more expensive but yeah that's amazing really really good value and like quite a lot of perfume there as well to try so so far i've had three perfumes which is a little bit different for an advent calendar okay on to day number seven up here one of the bigger drawers what have we got in here oh okay this is from the beauty chef and it's a collagen inner beauty boost uh, it's a vegan drink concentrate with floriculture bio fermented blend containing pomegranate and papaya extract with zinc and vitamin c and sweetened with stevia this is something like completely different for beauty advent calendar for me never had anything like this before uh, this is 100 mils so on the website it just says exactly what it says on the front and then also says contributes to digestive well-being and skin health so 200 ml of this is worth 16 pounds so this is 100 mils so it's eight pounds so i mean that's yeah quite expensive for one drink i'm assuming you drink it all in one as like a shot well maybe not all in one but yeah it's one drink i don't know how i feel about that it's a bit random isn't it okay on to day number eight at the top here oh we've got an advent calendar classic here so this is from this works it's the deep sleep pillow spray this is the 35 ml bottle um this seems to be quite a new size at the popping in advent calendars this year we used to get the tiny bottles um all the really like long thin ones um this is a really really nice pillow spray this is the one that i currently use you just meant to spray it onto your pillow and bedding before you go to bed and it's just meant to help you relax and drift off into a deeper night's sleep um, I also like to spritz it on the bed just in the morning when I get up because it just leaves my bedding smelling really, really nice. So this size is worth £9.10. So it's, I mean, quite a pricey pillow spray. Um, but this is definitely my favourite one. I do have a lot of these from Advent Calendars. But yeah, nice to stock up. And you can't really go wrong with a little pillow spray. Okay, day number nine, this pink one. And we've got a product from Sunday Riley. This is Good Jeans. So this is £42.50. It's 15ml of product and this isn't their usual design they've actually put a sticker over the top with like the christmas design on which is really cute you can actually see the regular sticker underneath 
but a little bit different for Christmas. So this is a glycolic acid treatment. This works to exfoliate the skin and repair any damage. It just makes your skin look brighter, look healthier and helps remove congestion as well. So it's a good little treatment. This is something that I would use at night time. Um, so after I've washed my face, I would pop this on before my moisturiser. So this just says the Good Jeans Glycolic penetrates the surface of the skin with tiny glycolic acid molecules sinking deeper into the skin than other forms of AHA to break apart pore clogging, debris and repair the look of sun damaged, congested, wrinkled or dull skin. With just one use, instant radiance and skin clarity are visibly boosted. Um, it's balanced with fermented prickly pear extract which is perfect for sensitive skin to soothe and calm the complexion along with skin purifying lemongrass extract. Um, so it's really nice, I have used this before. It says you can use it morning or night, but again, like I said, this is something that I would use at night. And that is a really, really good size as well. Okay, day number 10 now. Oh, and we've got a face mask. So this face mask is from Dr. Jart, and this is the Ceramidin, I wanna say. Uh, facial barrier mask, it's an intensive skin barrier moisturizing sheet mask. Uh, so a single use mask, this is what it looks like. So I've used this brand before, it's really, really good. I haven't used this one before. Nice to get a face mask in here. So this is obviously a full-size product and it's worth seven pounds. And this just works to moisturize the skin. Um, to be honest, I don't see much difference in face masks that are just like nourishing the skin, but I do really enjoy using them. So I'll definitely get use out of this. This is also said it's meant to provide deep hydration and also strengthen the skin's barrier. On to day 11. Oh, we've got an Elemis product. So in this one, we've got the Elemis Superfood Kefir Tea Mist. This is priming hydrating facial mist. So this is only a miniature. This 30 ml is worth £6.30. So this is said to be a four in one treatment mist. It's enriched with antioxidant rich coconut water and vegan kefir ferment. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Um, it's a soothing formula, tones, primes, sets makeup and refreshes skin throughout the day. So skin is looking fresh and dewy with every spritz. So this is something that you can use as a primer. So after you've moisturized and put your sunscreen on, before you put your makeup on, it'll just help to keep it in place longer. Um, or as a hydrating mist throughout the day. So you can spray it on top of makeup, on top of your skincare. And yeah, it just keeps your skin nice and hydrated. So never tried this from Elemis before. I didn't actually know that Elemis did things like this. So yeah. Really, really nice, a different product. Different than getting the uh, Pro Collagen Marine Cream, because although I love that product, it seems to be in every advent calendar this year. So yeah, different product from Elemis there. Okay, day number 12 is up here. Oh, got big on here. And we've got the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day Dry Shampoo. I've literally just finished one of these. This is so good. So there's 92 ml, this is a miniature, and this is worth around 10 pounds. This is quite expensive for a little dry shampoo. I mean, you can get the full size Batiste ones for a couple of quid. Um, but this is amazing because it actually cleans your hair. Um, instead of just like sitting on your hair and making it look a bit cleaner, um, this actually cleans it. So it works to eliminate oil, sweat, and odor from the hair. And it smells amazing as well. It is so good. This is definitely the best one I've used. And yeah, once you've tried this, you won't want to use any other dry shampoo. This is really, really good. On to day number 13 in the middle. Another classic advent calendar product we've got from Molten Brown. It's the Fiery Pink Pepper Bath and Shower Gel. So this is definitely one of my favourites. Um, really, really nice scent. Mm, so, so good. So with this, obviously, you can use it in the shower as a shower gel. Um, little goes a long way, you don't need a lot at all. Or you can add it to your bath as well and have a nice scented bath. These are really, really nice, always really scented and the scent kind of lingers on your body as well after you shower, which is nice. So this size is 100ml and it's worth £7.33, so I mean, that's quite pricey for a shower gel. Um, but yeah, like I said, you don't need a lot at all and it smells so nice. Okay, day number 14 at the bottom. Oh, we've got a makeup product. So this is from Hourglass, this is the Extreme Lash Mascara. Ooh, I've not actually tried this before. Oh wow, this looks nice. Oh, that is so cool. This is, it says Caution Extreme Lash Mascara. Oh, I love that packaging. Have a look at the wand. So it's not like a tiny silicone wand, but it's not exactly like a big brush. It's kind of a bit in between. Um, it definitely tapers towards the end. And yeah, it's a really, really dark black shade. That is really nice. You can't really go wrong with a black mascara in an advent calendar as well. Like most people use the shade black anyway. This is actually really expensive. So it says per 10 grams, it's £33.33. Or this is 5.5, which makes it £18.33 for this size. That is so expensive. I'm expecting really, really good things from this. This says it's an all-in-one mascara. It has densely packed bristles and a smooth glide formula to deliver volume, length and definition. 400% uh, more volume in one stroke. That sounds amazing. It's also vegan friendly as well, which is fab. 
and yeah that's amazing very happy with that one okay day number 15 down here and in day 15 we've got another perfume this is from floral street and it's the arizona blue uh, eau de parfum 10 ml i've actually tried this before mm, it's not really my kind of smell no it's not for me um, but yeah, another perfume to try. So, never had so many perfumes in that calendar. So this size is worth £12. There's 10ml in here. Um, it's quite a good size for your handbag. And I like that it's kind of like a long, thin bottle as well. So it's easy to just pop up in your handbag or lie flat. Um, the website says, this is a dry floral amber. It's a sense of freedom and happiness, scented and bottled. I mean, that sounds nice. Um, it's a vegan perfume for the sunny, euphoric, nomadic and free-spirited. And the scent is subtle sprinkles of Balinese coconut blends with the Madagascan black pepper spices and the second skin feeling of salted musk. So, yeah, I mean, that sounds nice. It's just not really for me. I have tried this one before, though. But yeah, really big bottle. So if this is a perfume you like, then yeah amazing okay day number 16 and i've got a product from liz earl this is the instant boost skin tonic uh, it replenishes skin with soothing hydration to prep for your routine so this is 50 ml of product so this size is worth three pounds 30 and this is basically a toner for your skin so after you've cleansed your face you can tone it to rehydrate and um, it's suitable for all skin types as well uh, liz earl is a really really nice skincare brand i do like the cleanse and polish so yeah, if you're a fan of Lizelle, then this is a nice little product. It contains aloe vera, calendula, chamomile, and cucumber to soothe and refresh the skin. And also vitamin E as well, which is really good for the skin. So yeah, that's a nice little product from Lizelle. And on to day number 17. Oh, we've got one of my faves. So we've got from Ren Skincare. This is the Ready Steady Glow Daily AHA Tonic. I love this product. This is so good. So we've got 100ml here, so it's not a full size product, but it's a really, really good size. Like, this will last a long time. So this is worth £10.80, and this is basically a chemical exfoliator for your skin. Um, so it does contain AHAs, which work to exfoliate the skin, remove dead skin cells, um, and brighten it as well. So this also targets, like, large pores, any congestion on your skin, and uneven skin tone as well. Just to give you a nice, bright, even complexion. So yeah, I've used this so many times. Um, I use this as part of my nighttime skincare routine, because it does have quite a few different... Um, AHAs in it and BHAs and if you do use something like this with uh, chemical exfoliators in your skincare routine you always must remember your SPF the next day just to protect your skin. Okay day number 18 at the bottom. Oh we've got a MAC lipstick. This is so good. So this is in the shade Twig. It's a satin lipstick. So MAC lipsticks these are 17.50 full size. This is such a nice shade. Oh I love it. It's definitely one of those shades that everybody can use. Um, so it's kind of like a dark, nudey, pinky kind of colour. I'm rubbish at describing things like this, but yeah, amazing. I love that. So yeah, 1750, and you can't really go wrong with a matte lipstick. I feel like they just last so long. Um, they look amazing on. It's a satin one as well, so it's not that matte finish. If you're not really a fan of that, um, it's really really creamy to apply, and yeah, a really really good shade for winter. Okay, number 19, another full size product. Oh my god. This is from Estee Lauder. This is the Advanced Night Repair Synchronized Multi Recovery Complex and it's the 30ml. This is full size. This is worth £60. I did receive one of these in another Ivan calendar, but we only got the 20ml. This is the 30ml. Full size product. Amazing. So this is a serum that you use at night time. It says this formula harnesses the restorative power of night to deliver accelerated visible renewal. Um, it works day and night to help skin maximise its overall natural rhythm of repair and production. Deep and fast penetrating serum reduces the look of multiple signs of ageing caused by the environment. Skin looks smoother and less lined, younger, more radiant and more even toned. So yeah, it sounds incredible. I've never used it before. Um, I am so excited to have this in here. This just sounds amazing. I can't wait to add this to my skincare routine. But yeah, full size product, £60, insane. Okay, day number 20 down here. Oh, another full size product. This is one of my faves. Oh my god, these days are just getting better and better. So we just had a MAC lipstick and Estee Lauder serum, and now we've got my favourite vitamin C serum. This is Dermalogica, the Biolumin C serum. Absolutely love this product. So I actually forgotten that this was in this advent calendar. So this is this 30 ml in here, and this is worth around £85. It is so expensive, but it is amazing. Um, you literally need the tiniest amount. It's a really nice serum kind of consistency. Um, I know with some like vitamin C's you can get them quite oily, but this is more of a serum. This is so nice. Um, it says to use morning and night, but I always use this in the morning as part of my skincare routine. Um, and at the night then I use retinol because retinol doesn't always work well with vitamin C. Um, but yeah, vitamin C works to brighten the skin. It's also an antioxidant as well. This is definitely my favourite and it's so expensive, so 
great way to top up on this. So yeah, I mean, if you use any of these products that are full size, like this one and the Estee Lauder one, for example, there's two products there. That's £145 already if you're gonna buy those from John Lewis anyway. Spend an extra £14 and you get the advent calendar with all these other products. So I mean, the value is just crazy. Okay, can day 21 top those? Let's have a look. So we've got a product from NARS. This is the Velvet Matte Lip Pencil. What shade is it gonna be in? Dolce Vita, amazing, love it. So Dolce Vita is such a nice shade. I've recently got the lipstick, I've had the lip balm in this, um, and now I've got the lip pencil. It's a very universal kind of colour. It's quite similar to Twig actually. I wonder if it'll map. Okay, let's compare the two. So we've got obviously Dolce Vita in the NARS and Twig in the MAC. Very, very similar shade. So yeah, very, very versatile. I think a lot of people could wear this shade. So it's a good choice of the advent calendar. Um, it's not just a generic red for Christmas, but it's not a shade that people won't use. So yeah, really, really like that. So this is obviously just a miniature. Um, there is 1.8 grams here. It does on the box say sample not for sale, but this size is worth £16.50. So, you know, quite expensive. Um, something like this, you can just use as a lipstick. You can, you don't need anything else on. You can put a lip liner on with it. Um, but yeah, these are really, really creamy, really hydrating on the lips and yeah, really nice colour. Very happy with that one. Okay, day 22, this big one here. Ooh, this is a big product as well. So this is from Fresh. This is the Soy Face Cleanser. Uh, this is for all skin types, rich in amino acids. It gently cleanses the face and eyes. This 50 ml here, and this is full size. It's worth £12.50, so great size. So this says it's an extra gentle gel cleanser that will instantly whisk away everyday impurities and makeup, even mascara, without stripping the skin of essential moisture. The multitasking formula also works to tone, soothe and soften the skin for a radiant, healthy looking complexion. So that sounds really nice. So this is something that I would either use as my first cleanse in an evening to remove makeup or cleanse in the morning because it sounds super gentle. Full size as well. Really, really nice brand. Okay, day 23 over here. Ooh, okay, this is nice. So I've got a product from Aromatherapy Associates. This is the De-Stress Muscle Bath and Shower Oil. Ooh, 55 mil, that looks huge. This is full size, it's worth 49 pounds. The value is insane. Uh, it says, experience the intensely warming and easing powers of rosemary, ginger, and black pepper, which will help recover muscles, aches, and pains. You warm one capful in cupped hands, slowly breathe in the therapeutic aromas and massage onto torso before stepping into the bath or shower. So you get 20 well-being experiences inside. Should we have a smile? smells so good. Mm. Lots of essential oils in there. That smells amazing. Definitely relaxing, calming. I'm just going to pull that in my bath. That looks amazing. Oh, I can't wait to try that. Yeah, full size again. £49. Insane value. Okay, day 24, Christmas Eve. Is this the best day yet? Mm. We've got a full size Charlotte Tilbury eyeshadow palette. And it's not even Christmas Day yet. This is Christmas Eve. What's Christmas Day going to do? So this is the Queen of Glow Luxury Palette. Oh, I've not got this one. I'm actually wearing the Pillow Talk palette on my eyes right now. Pillow Talk lipstick on as well. I'm slowly morphing into a Charlotte Tilbury. Yeah, and I've also tried the, the Walk of No Shame palette. So yeah, I've not got this one. The Queen of Glow. Ooh, <gasps> wow. Oh, they're so nice. So we've got like three shimmers and one matte. So usually in these palettes, we get two mattes, two shimmers. Uh, we get a base and then a contour, uh, like an enhanced kind of shade, and then a pop of shimmer as well. So yeah, we've definitely got more, more shimmers there. Really, really nice. Should we compare this with the Pillow Talk palette? So yes, yeah, so we've got the Pillow Talk palette there on the left, and the new one on the right. So I'd say the new one is definitely more kind of neutral tones, uh, definitely more wearable by more skin tones, I'd say. That is really, really nice. So this on its own is 40 pounds. So again, another expensive full-size product. This is like blowing advent calendars out of the water right now. This is insane. Since trying the Charlotte Tilbury eyeshadows, they're like, I'm just in love with them. They're amazing. They're so good. They're really easy to apply. They're super pigmented. It's so easy to blend. And yeah, I love the fact that they put like four together that you can wear. Um, instead of giving you 27 different shades and you don't know which ones to pick. These all work together to create the perfect eyeshadow look and all of them. Okay, so day 25 then. What's this gonna be? Oh, we've got two products. Okay, so the first one is Kate Somerville Exfoliate Cleanser, the Daily Foaming Wash. This is quite a big size, it's 50 mil. Oh, the other one looks so good as well. And then we've got a full size neon candle. Oh my God, 
Mm, I love this one. This is the one I've got in the bathroom right now. It's so nice. I think the full size of this is £40. So yeah, full size candle, £40. Um, let's have a look at this one. So yeah, the Exfoliate Cleanser. So this size is worth £14.16. It says AM and PM, use twice a day, apply a small amount to wet face and neck and massage gently for 30 seconds, rinse and gently pat. So yeah, it is a daily cleanser. I wonder if I can actually use this because they normally have milk in. So it actually looks like I can use this because usually at Kate Somerville products have milk in. So yeah, looking forward to trying this one. And then of course the full size neon candle, this smells so good. This is the Real Luxury Scent to De-Stress and it's lavender, jasmine and Brazilian rosewood. It's just so nice. It's really, really relaxing. I love having this one in the bath. Okay, so this is £32, not 40 I got that wrong. It's been specially formulated with natural fragrance, which not only smells wonderful, but also has a deeply calming effect on the mind and body. It contains a blend of the 24 of the purest possible essential oils, including lavender, jasmine and Brazilian rosewood, all expertly blended to help you feel calm and banish stress. Honestly, this smells so, so good. I'm so happy to have another one of these. Mmm, this one's amazing. So guys, that was the John Lewis Beauty Advent Calendar for 2021 Unboxed. What did you think of it? For me, this is one of the best ones. I'm so, so happy with everything I got inside it. I think the value is just insane. Some different products that we don't usually find in Advent Calendars as well, along with the cult classics that we always find, that everybody seems to love anyway. So yeah, very, very happy with everything in here. So excited to try some of the more expensive brands as well. And I just think it is such an affordable Advent Calendar for what you get inside. So I've tried to lay everything out there and now uh, someone asked if I could start showing everything all together. So I'll do a little close up here. Um, but yeah, amazing. I'm so, so happy with this. Let me know all of your thoughts on this advent calendar in the comments down below and let me know if you managed to pick one up already. Um, I did post a community post uh, with a link to it when it was in stock. Um, so if you just click that link and just keep refreshing or sign up for the email notifications for when it comes back in stock, then you should be notified when it is back and you should be able to get your hands on one. But yeah, this is definitely top five, if not top three. So, I mean, I've not unboxed all my advent calendars yet, but this is up there. I'd say with Space NK right now, they're my two favorites. So yeah, thank you so much for watching this unboxing. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also hit subscribe and also click that bell as well. And you'll be notified next time I post an advent calendar unboxing video. And I'll see you soon for another video.